Mom, Dad, dinner time! It's dinner time! Okay, honey, let's get that. Dad! Dad! Come on! Let's eat! Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. Screws holding it to the door. If I can remove them, I don't even need to deal with the lock. Mm, screws holding it to the door. If I can remove them, I don't even need to deal with the lock. Didn't you hear the bell? Dinner time. Look, I just came in and found the door open like that. Probably my idiot brother. Uh, hey, was anyone with you just now? No. Not the doc? No, she went in the house. Oh, good. Uh, yeah, good. Brenda, you are wow. an angel. Oh, Excuse boy. a mess. We had to block the back door after a walker got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago, and I ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down. I'll go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I could eat a horse. Where's Mark? Now, don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. This must be Terry. <coughs> Gauze pads. I could use a shave. Some kind of lotion. So much morphine for candles. Smart. Musty as hell. I guess someone needed some first aid recently. Ugh, what is this stuff? Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. IV tubes, saline. What would dairy farmers need with this kind of stuff? Huh, where is that cord going? Is that blood? Where the hell is Mark? But Brenda said he was up here resting.
happened? <sighs> Brothers. What the hell happened to your legs, man? Don't eat dinner. <laughs> Clementine! Don't eat that! What? Huh? Lee, Jesus, man. Did you find something? Aw, oh, sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Yeah, Lee, what's gotten into you? He just had a start. They could use some goddamn manners. You're eating human meat. That's crazy. What the hell? Ridiculous. I'm scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Don't indulge him, Lily. There's always something with this guy. Mom, I was eating that. Quiet. What is going on? Go upstairs and look. You'll find a guy with both of his legs hacked off. This is a dairy, not a ranch. Think about it. It's true. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living. Settle down, honey. Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boys. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. You're all sick. Sick in the head! Lee, that's not a very nice thing to imply. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways, one way or another. Like y'all. Lily, grab a knife! Nobody's going anywhere! We got lots of use for y'all right here. What the fuck? The fucking black Put fuck? your guns down! We're walking you out of here! Near my Mommy, fucking family. I don't wanna die. Mommy, what did I eat? Somebody do something! <gasps> Lee? Lee? Ah! I'll kill you! Did God damn it! If you hadn't dragged your feet, come on, Dad. Now's not the time. You okay, Clementine? They—they they didn't hurt you, did they? Mm -mm. Open up, Lee. Those psychos have my family, and we're stuck in a damn meat locker. We gotta get the fuck out of here. This goddamn thumb sucker was the one who brought us here. Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. Dad, please! Could there be a hole behind these pallets? No such luck. Please settle down! Oh, I'll rip your goddamn Gems heads are pretty sturdy. We could climb up. Uh, but there's no way out through the ceiling. Come on! Try yourself! Fucking cowards! Dad! Uh, I don't want to know what kind. There's more of us on the way! Don't give up. We're gonna now. find a way out of here. Can I help? Sure. You keep your eyes open for exposed screws or loose panels. 
Anything we can pry away to open a passage out of here. Okay. They're not gonna open the door! You, you think a fucking apocalypse gives you the right Salt to mix. chop people into me? Pretty heavy. Think we could heave it through the door? Nah, door's too solid. Dad, this isn't helping- Come on, Larry. Do you really want to attract their attention? Yeah, I want to attract their attention. So I can fucking kill them! Guess your new girlfriend wasn't all she was cracked up to be. What the hell is your problem? You refused to give me my day's rations back at the motor lodge. And you went out of your way to be an asshole to me tonight. You must really hate me. But guess what? You're stuck with me. I plan to be around long after you're gone. And if you turn... I'll be the one to put the axe through your skull. Dad! Open up, goddammit! I'm not your enemy, Larry. I don't believe you. Don't forget, I know who you really are. I'll, I'll break that damn door down! Dad, you can't get... Uh, uh, <laughs> Easy! <sighs> oh, God. Dad? <laughs> no! Dad, come on! Dad! Oh, God. He stopped breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead! Somebody help me! Fuck. If he's dead... He's not dead! You know what has to happen, Lee. Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're gonna be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, three hundred pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you! We can bring him back! Lee! We'll mourn him later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He is not dead! Maybe you're right. No, god damn it! My dad survived worse than this! Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten. I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on, we know this guy's not gonna make it. Remember what Ben said. Gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee, I'm right about this. I know you've got my back. You always do. God damn it, Lee, I need you! Please help me! Come on, Dad. Come on. Wake up. Wake up! You're right, Kenny. Let's get this you over. You fucking monsters! Both of you! I don't want to see! I'm sorry, Lily. No, no, no! It's the only way. <laughs> get off me! Don't do this! No! No, no, no! Don't let go of me! No! Please! God help us. I'm sorry. I Don't know you it. fucking touch me! Clementine. Clem. You okay? Why, Lee? Lily said he wasn't dead. He, he was dead, Clementine. But what if he wasn't? He was, I, I promise. Shh. I know. I know. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else. Something hopeful. Like what? How about your walkie-talkie? Those pretend talks with your mom and dad. Don't those make you feel better? Sometimes. We're gonna get out, right? You found a way out? I'm working on it. You, uh... You think maybe we were too hasty? Only one important thing right now. Getting the fuck out of here. We did what we had to. What now? You got any ideas? The air conditioner. There might be a duck behind it. Oh, God. 
What are they doing to Katya and Duck? There ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. I don't know, Lee. Seems like a long shot. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Uh -uh. If we can remove these screws, the AC should come down easily. Lily, I'm, I'm sorry. Don't talk to me, Lee. Don't fucking talk to me. I know you hate Kenny, and me too. But he did what he had to, so we can all go on living. For what? He's got his family. And you've got Clementine. I've got nothing. You've left me with nothing. I think I may have found a way out of here. But I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver or a coin or something... No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for him, but uh, back at the motor inn, Larry... Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. In other words, my father's more useful to you dead than alive. If he was alive and had the key to getting us out of here, do you think he'd keep it to himself? What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your permission. <sighs> do what you have to do. idea which pocket he keeps his change in? You fucking vulture! What ring? My mother's. Don't worry, I'm not taking it. Here we go. Two quarters. And a dime. Just gotta remove these screws and get this unit off. You got it? Yeah. One more should do it. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. It's too small for us to fit through. I can do it. I know you're brave enough. I'm scared. Remember the treehouse? You held out for days. And I saved your life. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <sighs> okay. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. Lee. Didn't even get to say goodbye. Get in here. I got an idea. 
Stay here. Take care of Lily, okay? I will. slaughterhouse. wrong with these people? Maybe I shouldn't have simply in time through there. This room would give anybody nightmares. Dumbass is so caught up in his own rant that we could probably sneak right up on him. Just stick behind me in case anything goes down. When we get to the front, grab his gun. Sounds good. Okay, you ready? Yeah, let's go. Stay close. Outside the barn. Oh shit! Just guarding the place, like you said. Well, sitting out in the rain like a damn deer. Mama says we can't keep that many folks alive and not expect trouble. Pick one to keep and kill the rest. Not to pick one to keep. Not to kill. Not enough meat on the trail. <laughs> oh, I know, neighbor. This is Wait, my favorite focus. part. Focus. Where's Danny? When I let one say they can just walk right out. <laughs> you never even look at I'll keep an eye on him. He's ready to act what I say. See what he's doing now. What's going on? why you killed that woman in the woods. She was about to spill everything. You weren't ready to hear yet, Lee. Had to stop her. You gotta keep me alive. If you kill me, the meat gets tainted. You can't eat it. You're already tainted. You ain't gonna kill me. Just like you didn't kill Jolene. You don't have what it takes. <laughs> Fucking coward. Ah! 
This is not how the world works now. You won't make me kill you! Fuck you, Lee. You and Kenny murder my dad, but you leave this piece of shit alive? Fucking ass. Oh god, don't hurt him! That's Katja! Please, no! Lily, please, keep her safe. We were coming up to the house. We need your help. Yeah, when you guys didn't come back, I figured something was up. What can we do? Larry's dead. They chopped off Mark's legs and tried to feed them to us. Shit. Is everyone else okay? They've still got Duck and Katja in the house. And I don't know where the fuck Kenny is. All right, we're coming in to help. The main gate is too dangerous. Go around the fence and see if there's a back way in. I'll keep looking for Kenny. Do you have a weapon? I don't leave home without it. Ben, stick close. And Lee, be careful. I left Danny in the bar. He got what he deserved. Get up! Get the 
Away from me, Lee! Get back here and finish this, Lee! Get back here and fight me like a man, Lee! Hey, Lee. I'd say I'm sorry for leaving the motel unattended, but, you know. I'm glad you showed up when you did. If you hadn't taken that shot at Andy, we might not have gotten out of there. Were they really killing people? For food? We should have known something was up. How the hell do we foresee that? Come on, Lee. I don't know. I really don't. Katja managed to grab this while she was in the house. She said it was with your stuff. Yeah. I found it while I was looking for the people who shot Mark. Do you want it? Why don't you keep it? Sometimes it helps to have something you can document your thoughts on. <clears throat> How are you doing? I'll be fine. I'm just not as young as I used to be. Hon, go on ahead and give me and Lee a second. There's gonna be fallout. For killing Lily's dad? Yeah, I would imagine so. What do you think? It'll be fine. Lily will get over it. She has to. You're a better leader for us anyway. You're damn right. Listen, that RV back at the motor inn is just about ready to roll. I want you to come with us. I mean it. Okay. Yeah. Come on, Clementine. 
Stay close. Lee, are those bad people dead? No, they're alive and suffering. They were very bad people, but if they die, it won't be because I killed them. Okay. Hey, Dad, what's that noise? Sounds like a car. Oh, God. Not more strangers. Hello? Figures. Oh, crap. Baby, you gotta see this. A shitload of food and supplies back here. This food could save all of us. Not all of us. <sighs> Look, we don't know if these people are dead. If they come back, then we're just monsters who came out of the woods and ruined their lives. This stuff isn't ours. Dad, whose car is it? Don't worry about that, Duck. It's ours now. It's abandoned, Ducky. Don't worry. What if it's not? Well, what if it's not abandoned? What if it is someone's? We have to take this, Clementine. We need it to survive. Who says it's your decision to make? Hey, we don't have time for this shit. Like it or not, we need this food. Now get over here and open the trunk, Lee. More food in here. <laughs> Supplies? I'll take it. Great. Maybe we'll survive this after all. Duck, why don't you carry this? Okay. Got a box of food here. I'll carry it. This hoodie looks to be about your size. Why don't you hold on to this? It might get cold. It's not mine. We're not like the bandits, honey. We didn't hurt anybody to get this. Understand? I guess so. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. I thought they might work in your camcorder. Here, you can have some too. For your walkie-talkie. Batteries, huh? Think you can handle those? You're not gonna let me live that down, are you? Oh, God. Lee, you're gonna wanna see this. Oh, shit. Save lots. They call 
y'all bandits for your fucking rape. Oh, darling baby, look at you. Look at you. Oh, you need a mama, sweetheart. We won't let them bandits get you, will we? No. Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find thinking it, you're I'll safe. You know. Sitting there acting like things are the way they used to be. The dead don't kill their own. It's the living you gotta be afraid of. The people I used to call friends. The people who do... Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. I promise.